Hey guys, today's video is going to be a haul. First off, I want to show you guys this sweatshirt. How sick is this sweatshirt? It is vintage Nike. I got it on Poshmark. I'm not going to sell it because I like it too much. Maybe one day I'll sell it. I don't know. I really, really like it. First thing that I found are these Lululemon Soul Cycle leggings. They are a size eight. Yes, a size eight. Just wonder under crop leggings. I found this Patagonia jacket. It's wool really nice this is a women's extra small it's got like suede shoulders it's really nice found a bunch of windbreakers my thrift store has moved into like spring stuff we got a lot of windbreakers out this is a vintage nike windbreaker this is a size medium it looks like this the label yeah, it looks like this. It's purple. And then on the back, it looks like that. Nike Fit. I need to, like, look that up. That's definitely vintage. Like, the tag is for sure. On this North Face rain jacket. This is a size medium. It has, like, some peeling on the inside. When I first looked at it, I'm like, oh, it's supposed to be like that. I was like, oh, it's just a cool design. But no, it's not. It's just, like, kind of peeling. But that doesn't, like, affect anything at all. So it looks like black and purple. I found this Disney rain jacket. I actually have a red one for sale in my closet. Same exact one. This one is navy blue and it's a size large. I think the red one is a size small. Um, but this is a men's large. Like this is huge. So yeah, this Disney, Disney World rain jacket. This Nike jacket, this is a size small. This is women's small. This is vintage. Looks like this. Let me get the Nike Fit tag right there. This one isn't vintage. This is a size large. This is just a really nice, um, like, running jacket. It's, like, windbreaker kind of material here and then, like, sweatshirt material at the bottom. Looks like that. Vintage Nike men's shirt. This is a size large. It's just, like, a jersey shirt, like a long sleeve. It does have some pulls on it on the back here can't really tell though i think i've sold this exact shirt before this is a victoria's secret pj shirt and i saw this in the pj section and then i was like oh i'll look for the matching pants i found the matching pants too um but yeah i think i've sold this exact shirt before um as like a flannel shirt because you could totally just wear this as a flannel shirt but i'm selling these together because they're pjs yeah, super cute. Can you see? I don't know if the camera's washing it out. Oh yeah, it's like pink and it's got like metallic threading. Vintage Red Sox hoodie. The size large. Looks like this. Back looks like that. Yeah, there is a stain on this right here. Eh, nothing too crazy. Neff hoodie. This is a men's extra large. I just liked the design on it. I found this men's Patagonia Cinchilla uh, quarter zip, size large. This is just like the lightweight quarter zip, black. On this Gymshark sweatshirt, I almost passed up on it because you can't really see the logo, but I did. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it on camera, but the logo is like embossed right there. If I hold it up, can you see it? Oh yeah, you can see it right there. This is the Gym, no, the Shark So Soft sweatshirt. Looks like this. This is a size medium. It's like long and it's got um, like a kangaroo pocket in the front. It's Torrid Blazer. This is a size four, a Torrid size four. So that's equivalent to a four X. I don't know. I thought it was so ugly. It was pretty. <laughs> it just looks like this. It's got um, shoulder pads. I tried to look up sold comps and I couldn't find many. Um, in this color, there were like some black ones, but this like green color, there was only a couple. Champion reverse weave hoodie. I actually sold this exact hoodie, exact size, just the other day. Really nice. It's a size uh, men's small or women's medium. But these are like the really thick, nice champion hoodies, the reverse weave. Pink Victoria's Secret bathrobe. This says size extra small. This will fit up to a medium. Just looks like these the string really really soft some patagonia leggings nothing too special just gray crop leggings I found some beyond yoga leggings i didn't know about this brand i feel like i've seen this brand a ton at my thrift store but 
I just, I don't know. I feel like I see this brand, Beyond Yoga and Yogalicious, and then there's another one with the word yoga in it. But I, I feel like I've seen this brand all the time and I didn't know it was a good brand. But of course, my first time finding it, it has a flaw. Um, but anyway, this is, this is what they look like. They're a size small. And then the flaw. It's like on the leg, so it's not too bad. I don't know, hopefully somebody will still buy these. These are so soft. Yeah, I know this is a brand that I've seen often and I've just, I, I didn't look up comps. <laughs> Nike pants, these are the washed, washed jogger pants or something. I forgot what they're called, but they're um, new. They're from summer 2021. They're a size large, women's large. The tag right there looks kind of like retro. So I thought they were vintage. I was like, oh, that's cool. But no, they're very, very new. But they're just pink, um, just lightweight joggers. The Lululemon leggings. I think these are the groove. Oh, wait, these are reversible. I gotta put that in my listing. I think they're the groove pants. <sighs> they're a size four. But yeah, they're definitely reversible because there's a logo on that side and then on that side. I found a bunch of American Eagle jeans and these are bigger sizes, which is great. I love selling American Eagle jeans in bigger sizes. Okay, these are the high rise, um, hold on, the Super Stretch X high rise jegging jeans in a size, um, I think these ones are a 14, a 12 or a 14. The tag is ripped out when I measured that. I forgot what it said in the listing, but this is what they look like. Just distress. These ones are the next level stretch curvy high rise jigging jeans in a size 16. I've never found, I think that's the biggest size I found in American Eagle jeans, but these are like very distressed raw hem, super cute. These are the super stretch high rise jigging jeans in a size 14. The next level stretch curvy high rise jigging jeans, same as the other one, size 16. Were the other ones a size 16 too, or were they 14? I don't remember. But again, just distressed and raw hem. And the last thing that I found are these American Eagle mom jeans. These are a size six. Like this, they've got like this hem going down, hem stitching, whatever you want to call it, going down the front. I don't know, I thought they were cool. And the raw hem. Okay guys, so that is it for this video. If there's anything that you see that you wanna purchase, everything will be listed in my Poshmark closet by the time this video is up. If you're new to Poshmark and you wanna sign up, you can use my code, it is keeping it rad. You get a $10 credit and I also get a $10 credit, so thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.